This segment brought to you by Arcad ATVs, Bull Hunter Magazine, and the Buck Ball. Well, this week, folks, we have a very special guest here. We have Allegra Lewis, who is the Vice President in charge of marketing for Thermosel. So for all you people who watch our show and should sort of wonder about the, the, the mysteries the wizard has put into the Thermosel unit, we're going to open the curtain a little bit this week and have uh, Allegra tell us a little bit about how this thing works. Well, most of you are probably familiar with our Thermosel Mosquito Recon Appliance. And probably most of you know that it runs on a little butane cartridge, and the butane cartridge just goes in the bottom of the appliance, and you screw it in like this, and you turn it on, gas goes on, you hit the striker, and you get an orange glow. I don't know if you can see that from that far away. But uh, you probably wonder, well, what's really going on in here? So. What I've got below down here for us to look at are some of the internal parts and pieces of the thermosel. And essentially, you, know, you see the grill here, but what I've got for you is a grill and a valve. So just like we just did right there, I'm going to put the thermosel cartridge in. And basically what's going on here is the gas, when you turn that on button on, hits a button in here and it starts the gas and that goes in at a constant rate of flow um, and it goes into this black box here and into this silver cage so i'm going to give you a close-up shot excuse me close-up shot of this little metal cage now the thing that makes a thermosel um, such a safe product such a great product is basically um, the butane is going into this metal box and the striker strikes the flame within this metal box which you can see again is in here it's completely enclosed so it is not possible for the flame to escape the unit so unlike coils um, lanterns most other products that may be out there in the woods that have an open flame you really can't start a forest fire or get yourself into a lot of trouble with the thermosel unit or, or this appliance because you know like we just demoed here um, the flame is arrested within metal. Um, so those are those are the inner guts of the thermosel. <laughs> well, thank you very much for uh, sharing that. I think uh, for myself, I would use terms like the thingy goes in the doohickey. So having someone that's as well spoken a person for their company as you, this helps out quite a bit. So. Again, from Nate and I, thank you very much for taking your time with us this afternoon, and that is your Northwoods Adventures Tech Tip of the Week.